Hola a todos, hello everyone, this is Spanish teacher Paulino and in this video I want to show you how you can build your own multi-language phrase translator for free. I'm sure you have seen many pages like this where they show you how to say hello in many languages, Christmas or Merry Christmas in different languages. There are a lot of pages like this. In this video I'm going to show you step by step how you can make your own using Google Sheets and Google Translate services all for free. Now, if you don't have time to build your own or just don't want to, stay tuned at the end of this video. I'm going to give you a link so that you can make a copy of the one that I made and just play with it. Okay, first go to sheets.google.com. It's a free product and you sign in with your Gmail account. Then click on the plus sign to start a new spreadsheet. You can change the name if you want. I chose multi-language phrase translator, but you can name it whatever you want. On cell A1, type your first word, phrase or sentence you want to translate. I chose English because translation from English to other languages is the most supported. Now we need to get the language names and most importantly the language to letter code. For that go to a new tab and on google.com search for Google supported languages. From the search results click on supported languages from the Google Help Center. Here you will find a table with the languages names and the language codes. Select it all and copy the whole table. Now we paste this table on our spreadsheet. Do it on column B. But then we want to move the content from column B to column D. Just select the full column and click and drag to column D and we will have the correct order. The two letter language code on column B and empty cells on column C. That's where we're going to have the formulas for the translation. Start typing the formula with the equal sign and start typing Google. You will see a couple of choices. Choose Google Translate. It opens parentheses by itself and this is the format text, comma, source language, comma, target language. Our text is always going to be what's on the cell A1. We want this to be a constant because we're always, always going to use that as our text. So we do that by typing dollar sign A, dollar sign 1, comma, between quotations our source language, in this case English, E-N, comma, and then the target language, which is located on column B. So we start with the cell B1 and we close the formula with parentheses. So we have the text on A1, the source is going to be EN, and the target language on B1. And now, with that formula, we have the translation on the cell C1. We're going to copy that formula to all the other cells in C. You can do copy and paste, or like you see on the screen, you can drag that blue square on the bottom right corner to all the cells, and it will copy the formula. So you select the cell and then you drag the highlight to all the other cells, and it will copy the formula it will keep A1 as a constant, but the target language will change. So now we have all the translations for Merry Christmas in all these different languages. If you see an error sign like that value, it means that a translation from English to that language is not supported. So to test it or to play with it, just change the text on cell A1 and it will translate to all the other languages. And then you will have your phrase, word or sentence translated into all these many languages. 
Okay, as I promised, here's the link where you can make a copy of the translator that I made so you don't have to build your own. When you go to it, you'll see that it's view only. So all you have to do is click on file, make a copy, you can call it whatever you want. So once you make your copy, you can edit it so you can change this phrase to whatever you want. Remember that this is set up to translate from English to other languages. If you want to change the language you are translating from, for example, you want to translate from Spanish, the phrase will be in Spanish here, but you will have to change the formula. So go to the first cell, and instead of EN, you're going to change that to the two-letter code of the language you want to translate from. And also, you will have to copy this cell because all the formulas were before from English to the new language. Again, you can just drag this cell to the bottom Now all of them are changed and you are translating from Spanish. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. Gracias.